Hi, this is Dulcie Hill. I want to talk today about rituximab. I started it yesterday. It's used for, um, excuse me, it's used for secondary progressive as well as relaxing remitting. I want to report that it was about six hours. They're very cautious about how they give it to you. I had a thousand milligrams of steroids. I had Benadryl. And uh, I also had the rituximab um, over the course of four and a half hours. I handled it wonderfully. It, it just it was it was easy. In fact, during the last hour, they turned it up as high as it can go um, for the protocol. And I never had any reactions. That doesn't mean that you would have a reaction. So uh, remember, this is this is what's going on with me. Um, the good thing is that uh, I am, I felt so good, and it might have been the steroids, but uh, you know, a thousand milligrams or one gram of steroids is is a lot, and uh, to control the inflammation in my brain, my disease was really active. Uh, um, in the month of July, I had all sorts of uh, exacerbations uh, going on at the same time. Uh, the MRI showed it was alive. What they did is I had uh, 3,000 milligrams of steroids for two weeks in a row. So uh, um, so for a total of 7,000. Uh, it put the fire out as far as disease activity. I'm not dizzy. I'm not uh, uh, walking is bad. My legs are stronger. Um, I don't require a scooter right now um, and that's the good news uh, whether it's the steroids or the rituximab stay to or the the next day following day of rituximab I don't feel sick I don't feel tired I'm doing laundry up and down the steps one step at a time like those exercise I showed you um, on this this page but uh, anyway I will keep you posted on how I'm doing um, until then, please go to Facebook, join Facebook, subscribe to MS Frontiers. It's a medical support group where we all help each other uh, make dis big decisions on our treatment and how to manage our symptoms and stuff. Um, also, please subscribe and keep coming back. God bless you. I pray for every one of you and have a nice day.